I hope you guys liked my lip syncing rendition of the Backstreet Boys Chances, which I just found out was written by Sean Mendez. So awesome job, Sean. Um, and by the way, if you didn't know, I'm like a huge Backstreet Boys girl fan. I love Nick Carter. It's my husband. Oh. And fun fact, when I was younger, and I'll try to find a picture, my whole entire bedroom walls were covered with Backstreet Boys posters. And I love Britney Spears. And I like Britney Spears posters. And I love the Olsons. But, oh my god, it was, like, ridiculous. Like, you could not find a space on my wall because I had that many Backstreet Boys posters. Fun fact. Um, but I'm here at Star Bay because I'm getting Wifey, who, aka, is, like, my best friend. I just call Wifey because she's just, like, needy and everything. And be like, I want this! Like a wife would do, so that's why I call her Wifey. And we now I got my other friend calling her as well. But we're at Star Bay because I'm getting her a chai tea and I kind of want an oatmeal. <laughs> and when I was on prep, I was just thinking about like one time I walked into therapy. Yes, I go to therapy. So like whenever I say like I'm going to a doctor's appointment, it's like therapy usually. Um, but anyways, <clears throat> and I was like mad because a certain Starbucks didn't have something. I think it was like fruit or something. And I was like, we are talking about oatmeal. She's like, are you kidding me right now? I was like, no, we're not. No, I'm not. We're talking about oatmeal. She's like, okay. And I was like talking to my friend about it. I think the other week. And we were just like laughing about it. I was like, dude, that's how you know you're like crazy on prep. When you're like the one thing that you want and crave they don't have. It just pisses you off. But let's go get her a chai tea. And hopefully my Starbucks. Uh, my oatmeal. <laughs> Peace out. Okay, you guys, so before I do a haul, I wanted to see how many times I can swear in one sentence because some people are annoying the fuck out of me. So, like I said, two things to my channel. One, do not be mean or rude to me, and I feel like that's like a general thing all over the world. B, do not fucking say I have a fucking stump because I... And not a fucking tree. I understand in some fucking countries that people call it a stump. I'm not a fucking tree. That's all I fucking ask is don't say a stump. I have a limb. You guys can say a limb. You could say amputee. You could say anything but a fucking stump. Like, honestly, that's all I ask for. And I don't know, understand why some people will keep saying that. And yes, I know. Oh, I'm from a different country. Okay, I'm from America. And in America, it's a, a limb. Residual limb and things like that. I don't know how many times I just wore, but yeah. And then B. Do not call me any nicknames unless you personally know me. Like we have each other's phone numbers. It kind of just freaks me out. Like weirds me out. So just call me Mary Jo. That'll be good. Alright, but that's besides the point. Alright, so I'm going to go do a haul. Let's go with some better lighting. <laughs> 